Hi, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. The list for 2024 Ballon d'Or Award is out, and Lukman is among the list, and this South African goalkeeper summer. But then, why South Africa didn't even wait? I mean, immediately the list came out, and they saw that their person is on the list. They started comparing Nigerian goalkeeper and their own goalkeeper, and asking Nigerian why their own goalkeeper is not among the chosen. I used to ask myself, are you sure that South Africans are not lucky on a cold war with Nigeria? Because what is this? Like, what exactly is this? Can't you guys just move on? When I tell you people that this South African thing with Chidema is not just about whatever Chidema's mom did, but this hate for Nigerians. This South African, they have this hate in their hearts. Because when you say this one is an NCTF issue or criminal issue, it's just football. And yet, unfortunate South Africans still want to dig themselves in or still want to drag and call up Nigerian name. Why? Can't you people just break without calling Nigerian name? Huh. Oh. So this man made uh, a post on Twitter. See, I go to Twitter to just look around and know what is trending. And all the time, you, you will always see South Africans soaking themselves in time inside Nigerian matter. And I'll keep calling people out here. I don't think I'm leaving South African brokers anytime soon. So this man made a post and said he actually put the picture of Mabali and Williams. So this man said Nigerians will start questioning why their goalkeeper standing while Bali was not nominated ahead of Williams. Nigeria and always competing with us. I'm not understanding, Oga. You are the one that made this post. And you are the one that is also saying that Nigeria is competing with you guys. Like how? <laughs> but anyway, sir, I like what the or how the Nigerians gave him with Oto. I'm so happy about the reply they gave him. This person told him the reverse is the case. South Africa competes with us, not the other way around. We are miles away ahead. This person said, most Nigerians won't dispute his nomination, especially with the penalty saves in AFCON. Likewise, he still doesn't dispute the fact that Nigeria is better than South Africa in football. This one said, never start what you cannot finish. That is the thing. They are always poking on South Africans. Remember the boat for goods thing? It was South Africans that started it. Now, football, can't you people just have good news? And bless, just have your good news in peace. Stop mingling with Nigerians. Stop attaching us. Breathe. Okay? This person said we should ask why you can't keep our names out of your mouth. I'm asking you know, eh? I'm very serious. So this thing is very serious. South Africa. Why can't you guys just let us be? She Children Masha Sagana has come and is dying off. Now it's football. Rest. This person said, nah, it's not like that. We just like promoting one of ours. For me, I've known Williams as a young GK in his early days as a passport. So he earned this. <laughs> and this person said, Ole Buruku. Ole Buruku. <laughs> this one said, we don't have that time. Exactly. We don't have their time, South Africans. And this person said, how can we be competing with mediocre? Mediocre. Somebody help me pronounce that correctly. Who knows South African when it comes to football? My brother, it's higher me. Ah, can't even remember when South Africa played in the World Cup. No wonder the team is called the boys, the boys. Nonsense. <laughs> Just Nigeria has to give it back to back when you cannot respect yourself. And Nigerian said, when any South African person on X wants engagement, exactly, he or she just starts some baseless comparison between Nigeria and South Africa after helping you guys get a country and not end up like that, Palestine. <laughs> I have to stop laughing at this one very well. <laughs> he said, after helping you guys get a country and not end up like the Palestines, you guys still want to leave us. <laughs> You guys still want to live live of us for relevance. I'm telling you, because sometimes I feel like is it are they hustling for Twitter money that they now have to call Nigerians' name? 
in this Twitter money. But sometimes again, I, I feel like no, 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 no. This cannot just be Twitter money because why? Eh? Every here and there, you know, enter Twitter now just to scroll Twitter, you know, see South African tagging Nigeria and trying to drag Nigeria. Can't people will just be relevant to Tamisha and Nigeria's name? Oh. <sighs> This one said, L -O -L -O -L, there's law, you overestimate your value and importance. We didn't even notice he was nominated. Good luck to him. <laughs> okay, this person said, who be this? He dog. <laughs> I thought it's only he goat. Okay, he dog. Okay. The popular one is he goat, Sha. <laughs> So this person said, Limo, Nigeria competing with South Africa is question mark. We have always left you guys behind and it's on record. Mm -hmm. I trust Nigerians on X to give them back to back. But see, why are South Africans unnecessarily dragging, I mean, bringing drags to themselves? Eh? Why? This person said, for a country that got their only Afghan in the 1996 because Nigeria did not participate. You are all nothing to us in football, and I promise you, South Africa will never win a corner till eternity. We will always knock your ass out. Oh, mm, my Nigerian brother, thank you. All. Since someone cannot just stay on their own in peace, so this person said, We are not competing with you because you do not and cannot in the next 10 years accomplish what Nigeria has in football. More valley is just as good as Williams, but not winning the Afghan has become a major stumbling block. Congress to Williams, but South Africa is not half as good as Nigeria. My brother, I totally agree with you. <laughs> this person said, Who they drag anything with South Africa? I would better keep that energy with about Cameroon and Ghana brothers. At least, what this person mean by Cameroon and Ghana brothers is that they are the people that are even keeping up to, to match. They are keeping up to match with Nigeria. I mean, they are doing great, just like Nigeria. Don't like South Africa, they are so backward when it comes to football. So this person says, South Africa is just trying to force a rival with Nigeria. In the real sense of it, there is no rival between the two countries. Atayao, Atayao, boat to boat, from boat to boat, now Chidemar and now football. Uh -uh. Oh. Okay, this person spoke Igbo. He said, no, bam. Okay, like he was trying to cheer someone that made a comment. <laughs> so, this person also said, maybe they have formatted. Okay. Another Nigerian said, maybe he, maybe they have formatted history in his country. I think he needs to visit a library to read about Nigerian. Then he can come back to see who South Africans should compete with, not Nigeria at all. Okay, people have forgotten how we saved you guys. Eh? Go and ask Mandela them. Hmm? I know Mandela has died, but someone died, just like this guy said, go to your history book. It will make it clear to you. Now we'll be the Baba. This one said, there is no competition. We are talking about a country that won their only Afghan in 1996 because Nigeria did not participate. Imagine the last time they won Afghan, 1996. And this man has their eh? What is even fooling you guys, uh, 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 Mura? Eh? What is fooling you guys, courage? Let me just hope it's Twitter money that you people are hustling for. Because if this, I mean, this thing that you people are always tagging Nigeria and tagging Nigeria, if it's actually real, that means people are, people are delusional. People need help. Okay, this person, okay, another person, another South African made a post. He said, he put a post, he put a picture of Williams and then made a caption that says, his name is not Stanley Wabai. You think concerning Stanley, concerning a picture. He does not play in the EPL or La Liga. He does not have a dual citizenship. Within concern, oh God. Anyway, you know what he's talking about when he talk about dual citizenship, right? He does not have a dual citizenship. His name is Williams. He plays in the South African Premier League. Now, come and tell me he's got a colonizer name. Before Uncle, eh? And people replied him to, 
This person said, looks like Nigerians are your new masters. You can't make a tweet without including them. <laughs> it's not being a new master. We have always been their master. But those people, they are living in denial. You can make your point without involving Nigerian, but it seems like you just enjoy riding in their waves so much. Exactly. This one said, that one concern on our papa. Tell me why South African cannot just leave. Leave and let's leave. Hmm? I was actually reading from my phone. It's true I said I'm not going to make video about South Africans on this channel again, but daughter of God was just relaxing on her bed, chilling and going to Twitter. And this issue pops up. And I'm like, what exactly is wrong with South Africa? Okay, since they don't want to rest, I'll be dragging their broadcast. I'll be dragging their broadcast on this channel. Thank you guys if you watch this moment. Thank you so much. This is for you. The kiss is for you. By the way, our under 18 basketball Nigerian team lost to Egypt in South Africa. Initially, they, are, they were denied visa, but after the public publicity of the news, they later granted the visa. But unfortunately, they lost. I will hope they become better and things turn out well for our sportsmen. All right, see you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed. I would like to know your opinion in this current wave of South Africa and Nigeria because sometimes it's confusing me whether all of them are hustling for money. Is it a wave on TikTok? TikTok, just I'm not dominant on TikTok. Sometimes I wonder are they hustling for money or it is actually hate, hate, hate. It's too much. If you have not subscribed to this channel up to this moment, I don't know what you're waiting for. Uh -uh. I don't want to see this in my mind though. I beg, click the subscribe button and join this family. I'll see you guys in my next video.